Hi everyone, it's Kristen. I just wanted to talk to you briefly about one aspect of the program that is completely optional. Uh, I do strongly encourage you to look into it, uh, but it is totally optional, but it is something that you might really find um, works for you if you are looking to lose weight and you're looking to get healthier. Um, intermittent fasting might be something that really works for you. So I want to expose you to it, give you some introductory information about it, and then allow you to make the choice from there. But it is something that definitely could help uh, catapult you towards a goal if you're working towards weight loss. So intermittent fasting, we, we actually, we all intermittent fast every day when we sleep. So if you, for example, if you uh, have your last meal at eight o'clock at night, you go to bed, you sleep, and you wake up, and you don't have your next meal until 10 o'clock in the morning, you've actually gone 14 hours without, uh, you've gone 14 hours without food. So that has been your fasting period. There's 10 hours left in the day, so that would be your feeding time. So you have already, you, you naturally, without even trying, you've done an intermittent fast. So what, um, what's recommended, um, I have a document down below, the, um, your intermittent fasting uh, and free day guide. And um, what that is gonna explain to you is the, the medical benefits, the many medical benefits that um, come from intermittent fasting. And they've done uh, courses, studies over the course of years to, um, to show that. And um, it's just something I'd like you to think about. And again, if you're looking for weight, uh, you know, as a way to kind of kickstart some weight loss, it's a really, really good um, strategy to use. Um, and what, what it, as you can see, I have an intermittent fasting and free day. And what we oftentimes do is you oftentimes can combine intermittent fasting with a free day. So what's a free day? I was doing free days long before I knew how good they were for me. It's just what I did. Um, I would be very careful with my diet um, Sunday through Sunday through my, Sunday through Friday, and then Saturday would be my free day. Anybody who knows me knows that I would always talk about my free days. And you, on a free day, you're allowed to eat whatever you want in whatever quantity. And when you're trying to be healthy and you're trying, especially if you're trying to lose weight, it's really important to not make any foods be. Um, illegal or bad or off limits and so knowing that you always have access on your free day to any of those foods kind of takes the mystique out and really makes uh, a lot of times can really reduce cravings for food because you know it's always there you know you always have access to it so um, what's oftentimes recommended is that you do a, uh, a free day and then you follow that up with a day of fasting and you can do a, a fast can be anywhere from 14 hours, 16 hours, 18 hours, all the way up to 24 hours if you so choose. So again, it's always an option. Um, again, I want to stress that it's completely optional, but um, it is something that is has been in the news quite a bit, and it's really something I wanted to expose um, all the teachers to, especially if you're a person who doesn't like breakfast, and um, it might be intermittent fasting might be something that would uh, really work for you because, um, again, people there are many people who just don't, have the desire to eat in the morning, and but they feel really guilty because they feel like they should eat because we've always been told breakfast is the most important meal of the day. Well, this intermittent fasting kind of, kind of throws a monkey wrench in that. So um, it's something to think about if you're not a breakfast eater, um, and it makes it something that's that's really beneficial for you. So please read the guide below and keep an open mind to it. Uh, again, it's completely optional. If you have any questions about it, please don't hesitate to post them on the Facebook page, and we can get a great dialogue going there.